Shake it. This is Showstoppers. We're at CES 2008. I'm here with Paul Singh, and the company is called Owl Link. What an interesting name. Thank you very much. Uh, we actually try to catch people's uh, attention with a good name. Well, it certainly caught my attention just across, across the room, and I was thrilled to come over and see what your product actually was. How, how could you, just in a few words, say what the Owl Link is? Well, actually, Owl Link actually uh, developed fiber optic technology. So you can use a transparent cable to do the high-definition digital connection, which is actually very, very, very revolutionized the uh, whole uh, industry of uh, wiring of your HDTV. Well, I just went through the, the situation of building the wall and spacing it out, pulling the HDMI cables. I have a sad story of a staple that went through an HDMI cable, so now that wall is going to be coming, coming down yeah. and so forth. And I would love to have had this product in order to, to do this. Now, is this for the for the video only, or do you have to run separate cables for audio, or, or how is it implemented? Well, actually, this is a very smart device. This is actually a very good question, because uh, because the uh, uh, fiber optic has very high bandwidth. So we actually can consolidate all kinds of data, including video, audio, uh, like Ethernet, USB, uh, R232, IR repeating, you name it. All the major signals in your home, that we can consolidate it. So which means that between all your devices to your TV can be only connected by this cable. So, so it's a multi-mode, it's a, it's a, a plastic clad uh, multi-mode uh, cable that's actually involved? Well, it actually it's a glass fiber, but it's multi-mode fiber. Mm -hmm. So uh, the distance is like within like, uh, you know, uh, kilometers, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so you have a, a single high bandwidth channel going in, in one direction, or is it a bi-directional link? Uh, it is a bi-directional. We have uh, uh, our proprietary ASIC, it's a chip that actually can uh, consolidate all, the, all different kind of data and then actually pass that through this fiber optic cable. Well, what sort of bend radius do you have on the fiber itself? You'd have to be very careful not to, not to kink it or, or uh, I assume during the installation it could be critical. Right. Uh, for the installation, uh, you know, because of technology, we actually uh, shorten the uh, bandwidth to make it easier for people. You know, we actually claim to be close to uh, like two, three to five millimeter band radius. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it just cannot go, you know, more than that. But three to five millimeter is very easy for go through the door cracks, you know, around the walls. So it's very, very easy to use. Yeah. So now, um, once you have this, uh, this installation, um, and it's, it's, it would be pulled into a wall, do you have to have a, a particular care in installing the fiber? Uh, not necessarily, because the fiber is actually stronger than people think. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, like inch by inch, they actually can be stronger than the copper. Mm -hmm. And uh, the only thing that you don't want is to pinch it. But other than that, you can stretch it, you can pull it, you can, you can actually compress down that, tap on that. Yep. It's pretty strong. So, so what links? I mean, I'm assuming that the connectorization is, is something that you do, that you're not uh, uh, enabling people to, to, to put a connector on themselves. Uh, right now, we really don't uh, recommend it, but for the professional installer, we actually provide the installation kit. They can actually terminate in the field. But uh, for the regular people, we provide a, a very smart coupler. So you can buy the coupler, can connect two different cables together. So you can keep extending the cable lens. So, so this can be routed throughout the home. This can be routed throughout the home, and you've got the, the entertainment going in one direction. What sort of data comes back, or where would you use the bi-directional aspect of it? Well, sometimes you can actually, uh, well, number one, you need like uh, the HDCP, which is content protection. You need to do the key exchange. So you need to do like uh, both directions to protect that. And our technology has been approved by Hollywood to actually secure the data that transmits through the fiber. But other than that, we have Ethernet, which you need like a bidirectional communication. We also have like USB, or uh, they use uh, like a battery connection. Or like we have, uh, you know, other, other things like, for example, you have a back channel like uh, audio. So you can actually send a video to the TV and strip the audio back, go to your home theater systems. So you can do a lot of things with back channel. Yeah. So, so, the back, so this is really an extension of your whole pipe 
of your local area network, your your uh, home theater, your video, uh, all of all of your media uh, to a distant location in your home. Yeah, exactly. So basically, what you can do is you can consider all your room as connected with this backbone pipe, kind of like telecom. And inside the room, you can use some other device to do that. But between the you know the room, between each TV, you can use this cable as your backbone, you know, data, you know, carriers. Yeah, so it's a point-to-point -point device. Do you have any kind of a multi-drop situation where you could go from one room to another, drop one signal, and then pass certain signals on to another location? Yeah, it's a very good question. Uh, we actually have uh, you know uh, some kind of a switching technology, so we can actually can can consolidate information from different rooms and redistribute it to other rooms. Yeah. So, so what's the price point, the retail the recommended retail on on the basic setup, and then how would it be extended? Uh, on the basic setup, you know, we actually sell through like Amazon.com or Circuit City. Uh, the basic device is like five ninety nine. We're actually including one hundred feet cable in there. Uh, if it's not low enough, we also buy. We also sell the cable package. Like for example, a hundred feet cable we sell for one ninety nine, which is very affordable to regular people. You know, no more you know wall drilling. You know. It just to make it a very much, much easier. Yeah. Well, and not to mention the signal quality that you're going to have through that uh, fiber optic pipe. Oh, yeah. This is like a telecom technology. So the quality is like, uh, you know, guaranteed. The best skill is possible. You know, this is a fiber optic, optic technology. You know, it's just kind of mind-boggling that people don't use that today. You know, oh, absolutely. everything outside your house is all optical. But why not inside your house to enjoy your high-definition TV? Yeah. Well, that's that's it. We. At my home, we just finally made the, made the plunge and have uh, have the flat screen. And uh, wish I had known that this option was available because it's certainly an attractive one. Well, when you buy the next house, remember us. <laughs> okay, I will. Thank you very much. Thank you Appreciate very much. Thank you, Thank, you so much. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Kick it.